What's up everybody, Justice Good here, and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can add a rounded border on your photos instead of a solid square one. So as you can see, before and after. Now this might seem like a really simple thing, but Photoshop doesn't really have a simple tool for this, so it's a few steps more than you'd think. So I'm going to walk you through it right now. You start with your original photo, and this vintage looking effect on here is just an action from one of my action packs. You can find those on my channel. Anyways, what you want to do first is find the center of your image. So I'm going to rasterize this layer. So just double click and click OK. Or, I mean, unlock it to make it workable. And now I'm going to use Command R to bring out my rulers. Or you can use View Rulers. Now I'm going to drag out some guides. And if you notice, it should snap to the middle, just like in my previous tutorial. And if you drag out the other guide, it should snap to the middle. Now that's the center of your photo. Now what we're going to do here is create a rounded rectangle using our rounded rectangle shape tool. Make sure it's set to shape layers here and what you want to do the more the higher the radius in pixels the more rounded it's going to be so let's just use something like 25 for an example if you want only a slight rounding use 10 pixels if you want even more rounding use 30 pixels and next to this star blob here which is the custom shape tool you want to click this drop down arrow and select fixed size and we're going to use from center now the width and the height that you want to enter are going to be 100 to 50 pixels less than your image image size so if you go and you have a if my picture here is 1300 pixels by 975 if you do a little math here I'll do 1250 by 925. So 1250 by 925 and that should leave us a 50 pixel edge on all around on like around the image. So I can check from center and just click on the center here and you should see the shape layer appear. Grab your move tool and make sure that it's snapped to the middle. You can feel it snap to the middle. And at this point you can turn off the extras so you don't have to see the guides and turn off the rulers. Now what you want to do is duplicate your original layer or pretty much just put your picture layer on top. And then create layer, create clipping mask, which is option command G as a shortcut and if you can see now your image is on that rounded rectangle which leaves us this small edge here to fill in with any color we want as our border so I can just create a layer new fill layer solid color and there is my border you can even do a pattern so layer you fill layer pattern and I can make my border something unique like this lined paper pattern or some slight texture just to make it look a little bit different than the, than the usual so there you go that's how to create a rounded border rather than the regular stroked border which can create a pretty cool effect so hopefully you enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, make sure you like, subscribe for more, and I'd really appreciate all your support. If you have any questions or concerns, leave me a comment or send me a message, and I'll be glad to get back to you. And hopefully you enjoyed this tutorial. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.